All of us at SAVE are devastated by the recent hate crimes directed at Asian communities, both locally and across the country. Like the recent murder of six women of Asian descent, we see that women are disproportionately targeted. There can be no doubt, sexism, misogyny, racism, and white supremacy are at the root of these heinous acts. SAVE stands in solidarity with our Asian family, friends, and colleagues in calling for an end to Asian hate and white terrorism. Our collective hearts have broken open and what has sprung forth is compassion for all who have been impacted. Today we make an offering of love and support from across the SAVE family and in our own words. We want you to know you are not alone and SAVE stands with you. The recent rise in hate crimes against the Asian community has been heartbreaking. It is unacceptable. It is unjust. Why is it that every time there is distress in our societies, it plays out against women's bodies? How is it that immigrant communities that work so hard every day to build this country are so easily told, you don't belong here? Who is it who is putting power in the hands of those who misuse it every day and they go unchecked? What is this fear? How long is this loneliness going to last? But apne aap ko akela na samjhe. Hum hai aapke saath. Hum sab hai ek saath. Together we will stand in solidarity. Together we will question the inequities of the system. Together we will put an end to the misogyny, to white terrorism, to white supremacy, to racism to systems that tell us we are not enough, to language that others us. Together, we will rise. Together, we are strong. To everyone in the Asian community, I see you, I'm with you. You're not alone. SAVE stands in solidarity with you. Estamos en solidaridad con la comunidad asiática que necesita nuestro apoyo ahora más que nunca. We are here in solidarity with our Asian fam. We are here to condemn anybody who's a bystander, participant, engages in hate crimes. We stand with our Asian fam. Dark skin, curvy hips, small eyes, long silky hair, not human, objects, promiscuous, sexual, exotic, Taken, used, worthless, othered, bodies, nameless, discarded, murdered. I see you, stand with you, grieve too. Holding hands, we are one. What have been happening in the news is really heartbreaking and I wrote a poem some questions maybe we can ponder and think about why this is happening I remember in my elementary geography book the definition of the US is a culture of melting pot when it becomes so violent why targeting a specific race why so arrogant we are all equal human beings. We bleed red in same flesh. Why the hatred? Why the divisiveness? I don't understand. How do you feel if this is happening to your race? Do you understand now? Were they mothers, grandmothers, sisters, daughters? What were their hopes and fears? What kind of day were they having before their lives were abruptly, deliberately snatched away when misogyny, xenophobia, and white supremacy reared its ugly head? I say their names, lest I ever forget the precious lives lost because a white man was having an off day. Sun Chung Park, Hyun Jung Grant, Sun Cha 
Kim, Yong Hae Yu, Delena Ashley Wen, Xiaojie Tan, Daoyue Feng.